Hi, this is DOSBox Mom, and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles. It's the beginning of the second week of the second month. We've just cleared the quest guard in the southeast corner of the map that wanted the whites. And that quest guard did warn about some guardians. So there's bound to be an ambush down there, which is why I did not have Caitlin attempt to enter that area herself. I waited for Cuthbert and Tarnum to bring up their troops. And it's now Weasel Week. You know, surprisingly enough for it being Gog Week last week, I did not see any random stacks of Gogs hanging around the map. <laughs> so, whatever. Okay, we have a little bit extra gold here. Probably the ambush is going to be triggered when I head for that stack of gems. Your barbarian instincts tell you that the demons wouldn't leave this place unguarded. You see nothing at first, but the faintest odor of sulfur gives away the presence of your attackers. They must have seen something in your expression because lots of magogs suddenly attack. Yeah, no actual demons, it's just magogs. Okay, and... It's like Cuthbert's back up to 10 spell points. He's got magic arrow that he can cast on the Magogs. Ooh, it does a little more damage now. And of course the Magogs are missile troops, so we'll want to just move the troops up as quickly as we can. One good reason being that that'll prevent the Magogs from using their ranged attack. Oh, good. The caretaker of this key master's tent seems happy to see you. Ah, finally, someone worthy, he says. I shall send word immediately to the border guard that you be allowed to pass. Okay, and there's that purple border guard up there. Yeah, we'll want to start hiring troops from all the castles. I did actually build the castle gate at the two Inferno castles last turn. Didn't have anything else to spend the money on, and there's no AI heroes to recapture the castles from me, so why not? Yeah, and everything's been built at this particular Inferno Castle. This is the one that used to be the Blue Castle. Okay, we can still build the Brimstone Storm Clouds, and it looks like there's still like a level or two of Mage Guild we could build here. Okay, now let's see who's closest to, yeah, I'll have, so I'm going to bring the swordsman toward the Arathian castle, then we'll have Tyrus come out of garrison, hire the archers from the archer tower. And pick up those swordsmen from Sanya. And then upgrade those. And... Maybe start heading her troops towards wherever Tarnum is. 
Okay, and then Caitlin is close to the petals outside that first Inferno Castle. I don't think we have a garrison here on side there. Adric can start hiring troops from all the creature generators up here. We'll have we'll let Cuthbert continue gathering troops. In fact, Cuthbert we should probably have clear that Medusa stores, which is something we forgot to clear before. Not that we have to, but yeah. Oh I wonder. You know, if we send Tarnum to that magic well. He could get his spell points back. That might be something worth sending Tarnum to. I mean, uh, Cuthbert to as well. Okay. Now, in fact, I think I will send Cuthbert to clear the Medusa stores right now. He could use the experience anyway. This is probably one reason we were able to take that first Inferno Castle so quickly. was that we <laughs> didn't bother with this before. But we managed okay anyway. Oh crap. Yeah, kind of hard to take advantage of the Royal Griffins being able to attack again if they've been turned to stone. Okay. Uh, let's see. Maybe this stack. And then we'll have the familiars attack that stack. And start heading them um, towards those other that that very last Medusa. Which they cannot quite reach. Well, I woke up the Royal Griffins. Okay, and Cuthbert is maxed out on his experience now. So I guess Sonia would be the next. And Sonia is actually quite close. Okay, so Sonia, we're going to have you take over Cuthbert's troops. Including all of Cuthbert's artifacts. Then we will have you and 
<coughs> Cuthbert and Tarnum all make sure you visit all three castles and learn as many spells as you possibly can. And Tiris, you can give those troops back to Sonya now. Like at least the Royal Griffins and the Crusaders. Now if you think you can find Tarnum. Okay. And meanwhile, yeah, we'll have. Oh, here we go. Yeah, although actually maybe we should just have Caitlin head up towards Edric up there. Yeah, okay, we can build the Mage Guild level 3. Now we'll have Tarnum get back to full spell points. And Cuthbert will have you visit each of the castles so you can learn all the spells. And Sonya. We'll have you head towards the this castle and we'll learn spells from them. And Edric will have you finish hiring troops from the creature generators in the area. And Caitlin will have you take those troops he's just hired and go get them upgraded. And then pick up the troops we hired this ter this week. And let's see, maybe. Okay, she could try picking up the imps from Tarnum, maybe. Yeah, we can have T 
Tiras deliver her spear marksman to Tarnum. And if we can just get a little more sulfur, we can build the 4th level mage guild here. Yeah, notice the exchange rate went down because we control an extra castle now. Okay. And we need two more sulfur. Yep, now we can do it. Last night I could hear some young soldiers talking to their sergeant around a campfire. The subject was barbarians. A deep sense of shame overwhelmed me as I listened to the tales. Those barbarians will raid any village, says the sergeant. Even ones without any warriors. They plunder and pillage everything in their path. Nothing but mindless savages, I tell you. The only good thing about a barbarian is that they kill their own people about as often as they kill us. Unable to listen any to any more, I retired early and tried unsuccessfully to convince myself that the soldier was wrong. Okay. So, where are we trying to head? Yeah. Maybe up to her. And then Cuthbert, you're having him visit all the castles so he can learn spells. And Sonya, we were sending to all the castles to learn spells too. I know we could theoretically just head straight for the purple quest guard, but I want to make sure that these people have learned all they can. Yeah. Here we go. One, two. Give Tarnum familiars. Give these imps to Caitlin. Caitlin, you bring those up there. Get the familiars upgraded. I mean, the imps upgraded to familiars. Alright, Edric, you could probably pick up. Some people from Tyrus. There we go. And who could use? Well, I think we'll probably finally reach the purple quest gate in the next episode, and that. I mean, we'll, we might be able to finish the scenario in the next episode as well. So we'll see you then.